Bonjour à tous. Hi everyone. So yesterday I actually edited a video. Well, this morning. Because I was still learning how to edit. <laughs> me and technology don't mix. If you liked it, let me know and if you want to see that kind of content again. Today, because it's late and I need sleep and to also finish up homework, we are just going to go through one of the, the main reasons why I studied abroad. Why I chose to pack up for five months and live in France rather than continue my education in the States. There are a lot of reasons why I decided to do this for a whole semester. Number one, I wanted my French to get better. My pronunciation is sometimes ill and my grammar definitely needs work because <laughs> usually in the States I can't be bothered to fix it. But here it's necessary to have good grammar. So my reasoning was if I have to do it, I will do it. The second reason is that to immerse yourself in a language is the best way to learn a language. Immersion is the best way to get better. So that's what I'm doing. I am immersing myself. None of my classes are in English, number one. My host mother speaks not at all English. She knows a few things. She could probably make it around as a tourist. But, uh, uh-uh. No. I have to work my brain to speak French every day. I have to learn about archaeology on Wednesdays and Thursdays in French. I have to learn about ancient Greece in French on Fridays. And the French classes I'm taking at Action Francais, those are the kinds of classes I've had before and they're kind of my familiar, okay, this is how we do things. Um, but I am taking what I would put in my classic studies and my art history studies into French, which is intimidating, but it's incredible. I am learning so much, not just about the classical period, but about how to talk about the things I love in a language I love. So there was also that. Another reason was that it was required for me to do this uh, by my program, majoring in French at Elon University. You are required to study abroad for a semester. Now, oh darn. <laughs> oh darn, I have to live in France for five months. But these reasons kind of are more actual intellectual reasons. And the one that trumped all of them was that I love the French culture. I wanted to experience it firsthand. I wanted to see the French way of life unfold around me. And that is exactly what I'm getting to experience. I get on the tram and I listen to people. They'll be talking about a boyfriend or an ex-boyfriend as was the case tonight. <laughs> or they'll be talking about their friends. They'll be talking about their parents. And eavesdropping isn't nice but I do this in English anyway so it's fine. And it's not like I join in the conversation or anything. I'm just there subtly listening. And that is another way to improve my French. And that's the intellectual excuse. I just want to listen to them talk about what they think about their own lives. Because perspective, like I think I've mentioned in one of my other videos, is everything. I want to look at the way the French see this big world we have. I want to challenge my own worldview a little bit. And this was the best way to do that, to take myself away from everything I know and to put myself in a new room with a new family 
and to say okay adjust and go and so far so good I am having the best time I mean is it frustrating sometimes oh yeah there will not be just this blissful study abroad experience no no there are times you're gonna hate it <laughs> but for me that's only lasted about two seconds and it's more of administration things and having to make phone calls in French making phone calls in a foreign language mm -hmm. no I don't I hate making phone calls in English I hate it I can't do it <laughs> making phone calls in French is something I completely hate it's so intimidating Ugh. but I am here because I want to be here and I am so lucky that I get to say that I said probably in high school I want to live in France I want to know how they do things I want to see their world and now I'm doing it that's that's amazing that is amazing and I've been here almost a month now I have been here almost a month that's bizarre it's already been a month another thing if you decide to study abroad time will actually fly it's kind of scary but this is why I decided studying abroad would be the best thing for me. This is why I decided to make my French studies a major instead of a minor. This is why I'm getting a French degree. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that. There was more structure to this one. It just won't be all fancy with the editing because I don't have time. <laughs> <laughs> Quite simply, I don't have time, and I don't think I stalled for too long in this one, anyway. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm sorry my video yesterday was late, um, but as I explained in the description and in this video, editing, that, that, <laughs> let's just not. Alright, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and leave me a comment telling me if there's anything you'd like to talk about or like my opinion on in the next video tomorrow. I will see y'all. <laughs> Bye. Au revoir.